Hi friends. <sighs> How's it going? Um, what is it? Happy hump day. You're halfway through the week. What you up to? Um, tonight, well, it's not really tonight yet, but tonight, today, um, I want to talk a little bit about our foundation and making it look the way that you want it to look. Um, like I said, it's all about the finish and you can make it like however you want. And so I want to show you um, what I like to do and how I do it. So, um, Tonight I have, I've been going to um, cardio drumming and so I'm just going to do like kind of a quick little finished look, um, nothing super fancy, but I want to show ya. So um, here's our foundation, what I like, ugh, um, I like to put some of our due date, it's a facial oil, um, directly into our foundation um, it really just takes like not even a full um, pump it really just takes a little bit and then I just kind of mix it in there um, and that gives it more of a creamy um, our foundation is wax based so um, it's not a full like liquid um, it's it's kind of just creamy, okay? Um, I'm going to use a brush. Sometimes I'll use a brush and then other times I'll use my sponge, um, my little blender full. So, um, and then after this, I'll show you what I mean with the finishes. Actually, before I do that, I'm gonna spray. Primer. This also helps um, get rid of the oily or like the um, shiny look. Um, I don't love the shiny look all the time. So, hi. I'm live. <laughs> I'm live. <laughs> um, okay, so. You can kind of see it goes on super easy. Um, with it being a waxed base, it feels like skin. It really feels like you have nothing even on. Um, you can see like it covers the redness right away. You don't need to layer it, but you can if you, if you, feel like you want to and you feel like you need a little bit more coverage um, but it is a full coverage foundation oh my gosh this lovely little thing <laughs> so I like to just blend it down so that we don't have any like distinct lines anywhere um, just Blend, blend, blend is what I always say. Okay. Um, so as you can see, I am a little bit shiny. And I, what I'm about to show you next is the cool part. Mm -hmm. Hey, Kelly, how are you? What are you up to today? I'm so excited for you to get this. I am obsessed. It goes on so easy and like it doesn't feel like anything you just you don't I don't know I don't know how to explain it but I love it um, so like I said it's really just preference if you like like the shiny type of look or if you like more of a matte coverage or matte look um it really just depends on what you want okay i think what i'll do too is after drumming where i'm like all sweaty and gross 
Um, I will show you guys that my face looks the exact same. <laughs> okay, so you can see that I'm pretty shiny. Um, up here is where I usually get in my nose. Um, it's just a little much for me. So, we have our perfect um, HD powders. So, I just get my really big fluffy brush. And you can see that it's going to take away all of that shine and that also sets this foundation um it will help make it last even longer so that you don't have to worry about anything you don't have to touch it up you don't have to worry about it coming off halfway through the day or anything like that okay so you can see that that totally took away any unwanted shine total matte okay those are our HD powders and that sets the foundation and then after that um, now everything is just really like you know neutral so I like a little bit more dimension um, to my makeup so I'm gonna do a little bit of my bronzer uh, and I'm using my angled brush and then you can kind of like suck in your cheeks and that's where you can put your bronzer and then you I always use it as a guide like top of the ear down and that's where you want your bronzer <laughs> And then again, just know um, you don't want, you see the difference? Look at that. You need a little bit of dimension. Um, if you don't like your forehead, you can put a little bit of bronzer up there and that kind of gives the um, look of a little bit shorter, smaller forehead. Um, you can do your nose, make your nose look a little skinnier. You can do a lot with this guys <laughs> um, bronzer if you feel like you have like the double chin business going on you can put this um, on like the down on your neck and then blend and that kind of just like brings it all up okay bronzer and then um, I'll do a little bit of Blush. Do you guys see this crazy eyebrow? <laughs> um, so really what I wanted to, to say about this whole thing was that you set it with the powder, um, make it last, and then you can just you build on, on it from there. Um, and then you can always spray when you're done with a setting spray. And then for a blush, I do a little bit we're just above where you're where you do your bronzer and you just blend boom um super easy really you it takes like two products okay you just need your foundation and the um the powder if you really like that matte look if you're really oily and nothing seems to take that um shine away you can do the the powders it's crazy how much it takes um that shine away so i absolutely love it um like i said if you or in the market for a new foundation, I can give you a sample. Um, it's super easy. If you guys haven't seen, you should go back um, and look because I actually can melt down this foundation and make samples out of it. So um, it takes me like five minutes. I think that's it. I'll let you know what my face and my makeup looks like after drumming later tonight. Um, I'm just gonna finish up 
the rest and it'll be good. So thanks for watching and let me know if you have any questions. Bye.